everybody. Good afternoon. Um, it's me again. I'm coming to do a really quick update. It's not even really an update. I'm just really wanting to express my feelings and emotions during this two week wait. Um, I talked to you guys because to me, this is more of like a video diary type situation um, where you can get feedback from people who have been in the same boat, same boat, who have experienced or who are currently experiencing some of the same things um, that I'm feeling. So I know in my last video, I was really going over my symptoms and everything thus far. And I've been really down the past um, couple days. I've been really down and upset. Um, I did something that I said I wasn't going to do. I did. I know I told you guys I was going to do a live pregnancy test and I still am. But I couldn't wait. So I took a test late last night, which was 9 DPO for me, and it was negative. So I've been a little bummed ever since I did that. Um, just really feeling like this may not be it. I don't feel pregnant. Um, the little symptoms that I was having, I don't, they're not as significant as they were. Um, my nipples aren't as sore. In fact, my breasts are starting to hurt a little bit, um, similar to how they hurt when I'm getting ready to start my period. Um, I have cervical mucus. Um, it's really thick. TMI is part, sorry. But it's really thick, white, and creamy. Um, so I've been doing research, and it says that sometimes um, you have that type of cervical mucus when your period is coming due. Um, I've had it for quite some time. It's not anything that's extremely noticeable. Like some people say they get a whole lot of it and they have to wear panty liners and stuff like that. I'm not having that problem. Um, I actually, in fact, just noticed it a couple days ago. Um, I'm not really tired. I mean, I can sleep, of course, but I'm not overly exhausted. Um, I don't have any nausea. I haven't had any spotting, which some people consider to be implantation bleeding. I haven't had any of that. Um, I mean, I just feel like I do any other day. I don't feel anything out of the ordinary. I don't feel different. I don't feel bloated. Um, I'm not as gassy as I was, you know. So the more I think about it, the more I'm, I'm starting to contribute what I thought were pregnancy symptoms to maybe the medication. Um, or maybe it's still just really early. Today, again, is 10 DPO. Um, I haven't tested. I am standing firm to not test until Monday. So I will do my live pregnancy test my early, early, early Monday morning because I'm going to do it before my wife leaves for work so she can be here um, for that. But honestly, I don't have any expectations for it. I just, I feel like it's going to be negative um, just based off of how I feel right now. Um, so, I mean, it's been really hard. And I t told myself I wasn't going to do that. <sighs> mm. I told myself I was not going to do this anymore. Um, I've been really emotional. Really emotional. Um, lately, I've been crying all day. And I told myself I wasn't going to do this on this video. And I'm sorry. But I kind of went into this having 
high hopes and expectations that maybe I shouldn't have. So maybe that's why I'm a little down about it and being really hard on myself. But again, you know, it's just one of those things that happens. Um, I don't have any control over this outcome. I mean, what's it done is done. But, um, it's just very disappointing, you know, when you want something so badly, so badly, and you've been trying so hard. We've been trying for a year, um, and we've actually gotten to this point where we can move forward and do our insemination, and we were both so, um, excited about it and really thinking that this is going to be it um everything looked good all my tests looked good you know physically i was fine there was nothing no issues my doctor said there was no reason to believe that i would not get pregnant um but again it is still early and um i very well could be but it's kind of like um, a conflict between my head and my gut. My gut is saying, okay, Brittany, yeah, you're pregnant. But then my head is like, mm, based on, you know, just everything that's going on physically and what's not going on physically, you're not. So I don't know. But I just wanted to come and give you guys a really quick update on how I was feeling thus far. Um, and where I'm at with the whole thing. So, yeah, the next video that you guys will get in regards to this, uh, will be on Monday. Today is Thursday. So I'll post our live pregnancy test on Monday and see where we stand. Um, I know we were supposed to do some outings and stuff this weekend, but honestly, I have no desire to. I really don't. I'm kind of like in a funk type state and I just don't really want to be bothered with anybody but yeah so that's it just wanted to do that really quickly so thanks for watching and I will see you guys again in my next video all right bye